Hey, 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 gamers, and welcome in, welcome in, welcome in to a brand new thing tonight. Last night's stream, I just feel like I have to address out of the gate, last night's Subnautica stream has killed my voice a little bit, so I sound a little off, but, oh, boy, am I glad that's over. Now let's get into something new. Let's, let's break out something brand new with, uh, we were here. A series of games available on Steam that are two-player co-op that Jed recommended we play after we play uh, Lethal Company. This isn't a replacement for the Lethal Company streams. We're also going to be playing GTFO. That is our proper replacement for Lethal Company. Uh, and I don't know if that'll last very long, but I think this will. I think we'll see how this goes and we'll have a good time with it. I think it can be fun. I think it could be a good time. So let's, uh, without any further ado, let's ready up and play the video game. I'm ready whenever. I'm, I'm locked in as explorer and not as librarian, so I guess that's the role I'm taking. I'm cool either way. Uh, we were talking about it a little bit pre-stream that, you know, we librarian gives me fear that it's going to be just sitting in one place or something. Like, or gave Jed that fear, and, and I agree, now that he says that out loud. I would normally go for a librarian, but for stream's sake, I would like stream to catch all the action, if possible. And if that means I have to play more video games, so be it. That's how brave I am, Chet. That's, that's how brave I am, that I'll, I'll, I'll play the video games. Alright. Ooh. Cutscene. I don't know when audio for us kicks in. I don't know when we'll be able to say hi to Jed. Our partner in crime. I need to get my cursor out of the middle of the screen, first of all. Which is a hard thing to do, because it's one of those games where you can't move your cursor off the window fully. Like, it blocks it at the edge. Trudging through the snow. I mean, it's in the streets. <laughs> Flare gun. Alright, so we're at some manner of building here. Yo, what up? <laughs> they look so silly. The little outfits look, look so, like, the little, like, snow gear makes them look so silly. Just silly little guys without faces. Shedma. Oh, are they dead? Oh, is whatever that is, did that kill them? Or did they just get out of their snow gear in a weird position? V ver here. It's like the crossing V's thing for W's, I see, I see. Alright. Oh, are we allowed to play now? Oh, it's that area we saw at the very beginning. Oh, having the graphics on high means nothing in this game. Jesus. Okay, I was I, I put all the graphics on high because they defaulted to low, and that scared me. Now, where's Jid? We're doing some exploring. We can't get through there. Okay, so where can we get through? I like this game's art, though. I really appreciate the art of this game so far. Like, immediately, like, its art style is leaving an impression upon me. Which is nice. What? What's that? Is that a walkie? Can I have it? I can. Okay, so E to interact. Understood, understood. I'm pressing buttons to see if I can use the walkie at all. Doesn't look like it, no. Does that allow me through here? Answer. The answer lies. Answer lies. Answer lies where? The answer lies. Okay. As in, like, the answer's not truthful, not where the answer is. Okay. Um. Double walkie here. There are, like, green and red here. There's, there's a green one. 
nose, like eyes, have anything to do with it. Uh, can he interact with you? Text on the wall? No. Okay. No. Oh, is that interactable? That drawer down there? No. How about the book? No. There should be a walkie in this room. I picked it up. Jedi, I have it. I don't know how to use it, but I, I picked it up. It was over here on the table. Sheesh, I'm not as helpless at every game as I am at Subnautica. <laughs> hmm. Like, I'm pressing buttons. Let's let me check the controls. Keybinds. Jump, space, crouch, C, push to talk, V. Oh, does that work? Is that working? Stop speaking to see if I can pick up anything on the walkie. Hello? Hello, hello? Hola. What's the deal? I can jump now. I don't think I could jump before. And I can crouch, which is very sudden. <laughs> what if I get down here? Can I get down and interact with anything? No. I take the candles with me? Light my way? No. No such thing. Uh, let's push to talk V. I cannot hear you through the walkie. I can hear me though. Do you have your mic set in the game? I mean, can you hear me? I don't know. Looks like I've got the game audio set and everything. Can't hear me either, huh? Man, it sure is great that we did zero testing. Uh, I love it when a game is designed. Audio options, voice chat volume. I'm supposed to go to Wavelink Stream as my microphone. Sound effect volume, push up my. Everything's set. Game options, maybe? FOV, mouse sensitivity, uh, toggle crouch. No, yeah. It's, it's all normal. Maybe if I hold it up and you speak at the same time? Try that, try that. I'm gonna keep holding it. No? Okay. Like, I'm not hearing my walkie go off or anything. This game has some movement. Look it up real quick. Yeah, we'll just we'll just hang out in the room for the first like half hour of stream, I guess, while you look up why the game isn't working. Here, I'll also I'll also give it a quick look while I'm just sitting here. I like the border that it gives me. You would think that would be. Push chat not working. Make sure Windows firewall is off. Oh my god. So. It's broken and there's no fix. I resorted to a FaceTime call. I'm playing our PC game. There's many reasons voice chat could not be working. We advise that you first make sure... Because basically the voice chat worked in the menu, but doesn't work in the game. There's no way a fault in our settings since it worked and it suddenly stopped working for no reason. Yeah, it hasn't worked for us at all, so... That or we could do VC. Let's, let's reopen a lobby. Let's reopen a lobby. I did set up my, my settings last second, right? It took my mouse away from me. 
I can't control the game. What was that? Oh, oh, that was me getting kicked out of the lobby. There we go. And my mouse is back now, so that's something. Okay, let's start a new lobby. Here, let me start game. Uh, create room. Can I just invite a friend? Room name. At the bar. Create room. Invite Jed. Shift tab. Hello, 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 hello. Oh, that works. I can hear you. Okay, I think it was just that lobby oh. might have been scuffed. Okay. All right, all right, all right. All right. <laughs> Thank God. Yeah. I thought we were going to have to... I know Jed is quiet. Give me a second. Uh, yep. Can you say words? Yep. Hello, 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 hello. Testing, okay, I testing, think you're testing. loud enough now. All right. Um, not loud enough on my end, though, so let me turn you up just a hair. There we go. Um, Fox. Let's go. Let's play the Let's fucking game. <laughs> Jesus All Christ, right. I was worried that like the voice chat was What's just wrong? irreparably broken. Dude, I love Reddit so fucking much. I love Reddit because <laughs> I went to the top Reddit post asking about it. I don't know if the voice chat cuts off in loading screens. That it does. I'll, I'll describe it to Jed when I get a moment. Reddit was simply no help about this. <laughs> a little bit of technical difficulties, a little bit of technical difficulties. All right, are we able to hear each other here? That we aren't. Uh, yeah, let's skip. There we go. And let me go reacquire the walkie. I want to be reunited with my friend. Hello, 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 hello. Oh, okay. You are so much hello, louder. Hello, hello, hello. Testing, testing, testing. Sorry, I had to fix that. Your mic has blown the fuck out over the walkie talkies. Uh, say again? I said I had to fix that. Your mic was blown the fuck out over the walkie talkie. <laughs> God. But no, what I was saying was I love Reddit because I looked up a Reddit post about it and the first reply under that Reddit post was, I don't know if you know this, but you can't speak into a walkie-talkie and hear at the same time. And it's like, fucking, they don't need to know how to walkie-talkie. They need to know how to get the voice chat working. Oh, I, I, I didn't know that you could uh, speak into a walkie-talkie and not hear at the same time. You didn't know that that's how walkie-talkies worked? Never used a walkie-talkie before. Yeah, you have to, like, let off the button. You can hear while you're speaking. That's why they do, like, the over thing. That's why that exists, is to tell you that it's it's okay to press the button and talk now. Over. Okay. Uh, over. Yeah. I mean, we don't have to do the over thing. I was just doing it then, because I was like, I'm, I'm saying it, and now I'm not doing it. You know? Over. Might be easier. Um... So, I, I'm in a room that I'm completely locked in. Yeah, me too. I got a feeling we're supposed to help each other out here. I flipped a lever about it. Flipped a lever about it? Uh, my gate's still locked. Oh, there's lights on the pillars, and one of them's gone blue now. Maybe we should use the over system, because I don't know. Yeah, over. We totally should do that. Over. My and over. God damn. We're still just talking over each other. God damn it. But no, yeah, we should do the over thing. Over. Okay, so we're locked in here. That makes communicating. So right now, are you looking at a room that's kind of like a bunch of hallways all connecting into each other? Over? Mm, kind of? Over? Does it have a few different staircases in it? Over. No, we're in different rooms. Mine's completely one level. Over. 
Okay, I just was looking at a map that did have that. Over. Oh. Over. <laughs> this is getting ridiculous. Uh, I mean, I guess it makes communication meaningful. Whoa. Okay, I'm looking. I, I'm finding a lot of books that have, like, riddles on them and shit. Is there more to that? Yeah, I'm looking at... All, I'm not seeing... Like, there are books here, but I can't interact with them. Uh... There is, like, writing in blood on the wall that just says, The truth lies, or the answer lies. Over. I don't know if Jed heard any of that. Can you hear me while I'm doing this? Over. I can hear you now. Over. Okay, good. Um. Uh Uh, hey, I found something. Over. What did you find? There are a bunch of stones in the wall with, like, symbols on them. And I can, like, interact with the symbols on the wall. Over. I've got a poster on my wall that has symbols corresponding to, uh, corresponding to eye colors. Over. Uh, there are two eye-shaped, uh, like, lights on the wall. One blue and then one green above the, like, uh, symbol buttons. Over. Uh, the first eye, the over the first eye, what, uh, symbol does it look like? Over. <laughs> well, it's... Okay, so the symbols are on a wall. They're like in the bricks on the wall, and then there are two pillars, one on either side of the of like one on either end of the wall. And then at the top of those pillars are the like green and blue like eye things over. Okay, do you see a way to change the colors on those pillars over? Uh they're not interactable, no. Over. I know Jed's a little blown out. Did one of them change? Over. Nope. Left one is blue and right one is green. They were both green last time, though, before we, like, left to fix the mic thing. So you've done something at some point. Over. Okay. You said one of them has changed so far. I haven't done much. Uh, let me try a few things. Over. All right, it changed, if it helps, it changed, like, the first time I looked at them. Like, just, like, as soon as we got back into these rooms. So it must have been something you did, like, instantly. Over. Unless it's just a combination thing. Jed is still a little blown out. Uh, here, I'll, I'll adjust Jed down. Do you have some way of finding the cardinal directions? Over. Finding cardinal directions. Let me see. I don't. I don't see anything. I don't have like a compass or anything, and there are no windows. Over. Okay. Um, I've got some film reel and a like old timey film crank thing. I'm gonna watch it and see if that helps us. All right. Is there are there like is there like a set of symbols anywhere that I could be punching in as like a code on this symbol wall on your end? Over. Mm -mm. Me. Oh, mm. uh, maybe I don't know because like the only symbols I'm seeing. Oh shit! On the cover of the books. Hold on. Over. All right. Sick. I'm ready and awaiting. Over. Each of these books had a riddle on the back and symbols on the front. So, um... Oh, this is the one. In the west corner lies your start. Keep moving north, but watch your step. Before the last tile, you must head east. After these two steps, take one step towards the south. Head for the eastern wall. Then you may proceed toward the door. I don't... I don't think you know the cardinal direction, so that doesn't help you at all. Try... Uh, okay, I'm gonna let you respond over... 
Yeah, my bad. I, I slipped on the walkie-talkie button. Uh, but I could uh, assume that the direction I spawned facing is north, but that's kind of a bold assumption. Over. That's a bold assumption. So far, the symbols on this book look like a cat holding both of its arms up, a penis, um, a guy kind of curling his legs back, holding himself up on each hands, a coat rack, and a sailboat with an eye. A sail, a cat holding both of its hands up. I'm, I'm seeing a couple of cat-like ones, but like, neither of them have hands. Like, you mean like the M shape, or? Like it, it looks like a cat. Oh shit! That's a. Those books have collections of symbols. Okay. Fine. All right. Well, let me know. Uh, just give me one of the collections of symbols in order then. Over. Jed, I'm begging. Literally anything, please. <laughs> I'm begging you. Okay. Um, so... See, because right now I've got a poster that shows me all the symbols according to eye colors of some sort. So I'm thinking it has to do with that. Over. Yes, can you please read me the symbols on the poster for Blue Eye? Over. Like, these are symbols I'm not familiar with, so I don't know, like, proper names of them. Also, what does Jed consider to look like a coat rack here? Oh, that one, obviously. Here, if, I, if I position my cursor, I can make it look like a little stick man. Do a little yippee! <laughs> What? You still there? Over. I'm still here. Over. Alright, because I, like, if you just said anything, I didn't hear any of that. Over. I didn't say anything, I was trying to think. Um, the first symbol with the eye, what, what symbol is there? There's not, like, a symbol associated with any of these. Like, it's just a wall. It's like a like a number pad of, like, buttons on a wall, and then there are eyes on either side. They're not really associated with either the symbol, or either of the eyes. Over. Okay. Um, and then the colors. Do the eyes have colors? Yes, one of them is blue. Yeah, one of them is blue, and one of them is green. The left one is blue, the right one is green. I'm just giving Jed the same pieces of information over and over again. I'm starting to think I don't want to play a puzzle game with Jed. <laughs> like, am I crazy here? I, I would love to see what Jed is seeing. Okay, because the problem is that these eye colors only come in blue, pink, and green. And there's about, like, 10 symbols. Or, sorry, 20 symbols. Three, so each of them share, like, eye colors. Oh, well, there's only nine symbols here. I could give you the nine symbols that I have here. Yeah, maybe maybe give me that. Okay, so one of these is, like, an X. The first symbol is, like, an X with, like, a circle in the middle of it. With, like, an additional line through the middle. Like, vertically. The second one is what I assume you meant by the coat rack looking one, the tall one with a couple of like curves on either side. And then the third one is an A, but the crossbar of the A is the top bar of a T. Like there's a vertical line in the A that makes it like a like a T. Those are the first three, you get that? Oh, I think I get it now. Hold on. Uh press the it looks kinda like an N, and then press the Press the what? Sorry. Press the one that kind of looks like an N, and then press the M. Hey, doors open. Okay, you've opened up a room for me. Over. Uh, you also opened up a room for me. I keep, for, I keep forgetting to say over, over. 
My room is like a big circle with paintings of different amalgamation animals with symbols underneath them. Um, what are you looking at? Over. I'm looking at a room uh, with a grandfather clock in it, but most importantly to our thing, there's like a wall of like tiles that have symbols on them this time that I can interact with, and then there's a painting of a real fucked up looking bird thing. I don't know. Over. It's it's. it's can you explain what the bird has? Like, does it have a shell, like a snail, or what does it look like? It's it's got like oh I see it now it's it's a bird head but it's got like mo it's like a bird body but it's got like monkey feet and like a human mouth and like face coming out of the ass of it over it has a bird head with like almost a monkey esque body and then the face and mouth yeah over. Okay, the symbols that you're going to want to press are, it looks like an F with two triangles instead of one line through it. And then it looks like a doorway with a line over the top half circle and like almost like a T, sideways T on top of it. And then a coat rack with three bulbs on the top and three lines out coming out the bottom. Oh. Yeah, I see what you're talking about, Jed. Uh, I've I've made a grave error when I said interact. I can interact with them, but these aren't like the stone tiles. These are like little tiles that I can pull off of a whiteboard on the wall and put somewhere. But I don't really see a spot to put them. If I drop them on the ground, they go back to the thing. Over. Okay, maybe I have a clue for that. Over. All right, I'll be waiting up. Over. Oh, Jed, I'm stupid. There are slots for them below the painting, and I just, like, missed them because they're below eye level. Over. Okay, so double triangle F, doorway with sideways T and half line through it, coat rack, three bulbs, and it has three legs. And a coat rack with three bulbs and three legs, yeah? Like, like a situation like that? Over? Yes, over. Like the place where you hang the coat has bulbs on top of it. Over. Alright, I put them in. It made a noise, but I don't think it took. Oh, it put, it put them back on the wall. Over. I don't think that was right. Okay. Say again, over. Right. Over. Say again, over. Is it cutting him in a out? bird head, almost like a uh I don't know that 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 the the dad from fucking uh, How to Train no not How to Train Your Dragon fucking Kung Fu Panda like that kind of bird, and then the body is the body and the neck are like furry like a monkey, and the face has like a mouth sticking out of the back of it. The face has like a. Oh, are you describing to me your painting right now? Over. Yes, I have a room full of different paintings, and we have to match our paintings, I'm assuming, over. Yeah, uh, it definitely wants me to put corresponding tiles into the thing for, for this painting. Um, but I'm looking at it, and yeah, it's, it's a monkey's body, is what I'm seeing here. It looks like, it looks like it's got, like, a horse tail, almost? Like, it's, it's regular hair on the tail. And then a human face with its tongue out sticking out of the back, and a like a bird head. What is that? Like a peacock head there? I'm not sure. Either way, over. And the guy is looking straight up into the air with his tongue face. His nose facing straight up. 
Yep, over. Okay, then try that again. It kind of looks like an F with a little extra tail on it with two triangles through it. Hold on, are these whole triangles or are these just like downward lines? Like are they are the triangles topped off or over? The triangles are not topped off, they're just The triangles are not topped off, they're just like arrows. Gotcha, that's the first one. What's the second one? The second one is almost like a doorway with a line at the very top of it, and then a T touching the top of it, so it kind of almost looks like a key on top of it. Over. Yeah, I'm looking, yeah, an archway with a, with a, like, a sideways T coming off of the top of it, and then there's, like, a line through the middle making the archway kind of fill out like an A, but... I'm not sure if that's the right one, because that's the one I put in last time, over. That is the right one, yes. Ah, I see the mistake I made, Jed. I see the mistake I made. There are two symbols that kind of look like a hat rack with bulbs coming off the top of it with three legs. Okay, yes. That's the mistake I made. There we go, door open, over. Copy, over. I don't think we're ever gonna meet up. Um, I keep expecting one of these to be we meet up and do the rest of the puzzles, but I think that is the puzzles that we get different rooms. All right, what are you looking at? Did you get a room too, or is it just me? Over. I have gotten a room, and it is a very long set of staircases with like uh -oh. armor stands and shit. Uh -oh. And I I have three pipes that seem like they can be twisted in a certain order, they all correspond to a different color over- Sh What are you looking up. at? Uh, shut the fuck up. I'm looking at a room that is slowly flooding over. It's got like- Oh wait, no, hold on. It's got like pipes and shit. I'm locked in here. Uh, there's a little like cable with nothing on it, but I can use it to get into like a window. But the window comes into like a pocket of nothing. Over. Yeah, are you not drowning anymore? Over? Uh, yeah, it, it opened the door and it stopped drowning. Over. I don't know what he did, but it worked. Okay, well, luck yes, I just shifted a bunch of different valves in different orders, and uh, I got the combination right. Over. Oh, I got two achievements for that one, so I think it's, you know, I, don't, I, I think you did, like, some kind of cheesy bullshit the game intended. Over. Alright, well, um... Are you seeing anything else in this flooded room, then? Over? No, I got out of the room, and now I'm in, like, a, a hallway with, like, an and gate, or, like, an or gate, where if I flip a lever, like, one of the doors opens and one of the doors closes. It's in, like, an airlock formation, if that makes sense. So I can open the lever, get in the door. It's like, it's like the puzzle from the beginner's guide, is what I'm looking at, if that makes any sense to you. Over. Okay, do those gates have corresponding colors over? No, they were both white. I figured it out. I just had to, like, flip the lever while I was standing in between them. I got the right. Don't worry. Over. <laughs> over. Right. Uh, this handwriting is very hard to read. But... Uh, I'm looking at, I'm looking at blood on the wall again that just says, bring down the guiding, bring down the guiding light. Over. I don't know what that means. Let's see, is there anything else in here? Oh, there's shit over here. I'm not seeing anything that would correspond to guiding light, so I'm not sure over. Right, there's more to the room here. I, I just thought I just thought that might be relevant because it's the first thing that I saw that looked of note. But the last like blood on the wall wasn't really relevant to the puzzle either. Um, it looks like a bunch of hallways intersecting. There's there's another painting in here. 
There's no like holes or anything though. It's it's of a dog with like a candelabra head, which is weird. Uh, but it, again, it looks like the first room you described, but without the staircases. It's just like, oh no, there's staircases, but it's just like a bunch of inter intersecting hallways. Was that you? Jed, was that you? Over. I don't know what you're talking about, and so. I stepped through a hallway and I just saw like a figure like walk like around a corner I was looking at over. I'll retrace my steps maybe over. Yeah, I'll hang out in this corner for a minute and see if you show. I'm pretty sure it was something to do with the game though. So, but I'm, I'm in like a set of corridors right now with stairs over. Maybe okay, well, I'm pretty sure that wasn't... I'm pretty sure that was just a spook and that wasn't me. But in... Are you in, like, a room area of one of these corridors? Over? I am now, yeah. Uh, it doesn't look like there's anything in here with me, though. Oh, there's a green gate here. Over. Alright, now we give Jed a second to respond. If he may... I think he's trying to figure out what to do about about Green Gate. I'm scared now. Some manner of beastie may lie within these walls. Vox? I'm sorry, all that came through was fucking and nothing else. Over. <laughs> okay, well, in the room that you're in, describe to me how many crates and barrels and shit are in there. Over. I'm not seeing a single crate or barrel, uh, and none beyond the door either. Over. Okay, we must be looking at different- or I must be looking at Clue for later then. Over. Yeah, I'm not even really seeing much that would constitute a Clue. Here's- here's like a cat with like bat wings. Does that, you know, sound like anything from that like painting room you were in? Over. Gate, but it's open, this one. No, I'm not seeing any cat with bat wings paintings. Over. Okay, alright, I found something. Let's see what happens. Hold on. Over. Okay, figured it out. I'm in a room with some crates, and I don't think any barrels. I'll double check. I'm looking around. It's a pretty big room. Uh, but... There is a blue gate and a green gate. I can open and close the green gate on my own, but I can't open and close the blue gate. Over. Okay, how many crates and barrels did you say it had? I'm looking at four crates total and zero barrels. Over. Does the room kind of have a jutting out portion and kind of almost looks like a really wide L? L. Um, no, I don't. I don't. It, it's hard to tell from like a non-top-down perspective, but like I don't. I don't see anything that looks like that. It's pretty square. There are pillars all around. Over. Okay. Does it have two staircases going out of it or into it from uh, like opposing corners? Over. Yes, it has exactly that. Over. Okay, that's great. So we are looking at the same thing. Uh, bad thing. I don't... This used to have colored gates, like you were saying. I don't know where the colored gate went, gates went on this map. Over. Here, does this bring them back? Over. Take that as a no. Okay, never mind, I'm stupid. I had flipped a wrong lever that I had unflipped at the beginning of it. Whatever, who cares. But I see a blue gate and a green gate. That's right, over. Okay, so you came in through the white gate, right? I came into this whole, like, big labyrinth through the white gate, but I came into this room through the green gate. I need to get through the blue gate, over. 
Okay, so go back through the green gate and walk down the hallway until you get to the red gate that's open. There's a red gate just outside of the green gate that's closed. Is that what you mean? Over? No, continue down the hallway until you get to the open red gate. Over. Got it. Over. I'll look out. Right, I'm at the open red gate. Where to now? Over. Okay, so now if you turn, like, and keep going down the hallway, uh, you should come to, like, a intersection of, like, you can either go left or right. Over. Yeah, there's a staircase up the red gate and then a left and right. Just to double check that we're talking about the same place. Over. Okay, so go up the staircase and then turn right. All right, over. It should round the corner and you should come out to a big room with a closed green gate, a staircase on each side. There's a closed green gate and an up staircase and a down staircase on either side. Yep, over. Okay, did you do something? Because I lost all my uh, symbols. No, I haven't touched your symbols. I'm just chilling. I'm just walking around. Over. Okay, so I guess I have to do this every so often. But, um, when you walked through the door, the hallway that you walked in from, go up or down the staircase on the right. The one on the far side of the room from where I came in? On the right? Yes. Got it. I've rounded the corner from that staircase and come to an open blue gate. Is that correct? Over. That is correct. Walk through the blue gate and then Wait, down or up the stairs. Okay, down or up the stairs. Statues. All right, where to next? Over. Continue through that hallway until you should see a room to your left or a staircase to your left that goes to a room. Uh, there's a staircase to my left that goes to a room. Yes, I'm here. Over. Mm. A big burp. Okay, I see what you have to do. I'm sorry. Could you make your way back to that room with the green lever? I... You what? Sorry, over. I just figured out the puzzle. Could you go back to the room with the green gate? The open green gate? Yeah, there's a blue switch in here, by the way. Over. Uh, yes. We're gonna need that later. So just go back to the original room, please. Over. I'm making my way back. Over. This game is so involved, there's no like like chit chatty like downtime or anything. Over. Okay, have you made back to the green room? Over. I'm still walking. Over. Alright, I'm back in the green room just now. Over. Room. I'm so sorry. What did you say? Over. Please go back to the blue switch room. I'm so sorry. I've led you I'm astray once more. I'm never playing a puzzle more. game with over. this motherfucker again. I'm never playing a puzzle game with you ever again. Over. <laughs> I am so, so sorry. I, 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 the map is really fucked, man. Over. I don't buy it. Over. <laughs> Alright, let's get Just back to the Just fucking tell me when you get to the blue switch room, over. I'm almost there, hold on a second, over. <laughs> now the fun begins of Jed running me in circles. I think it was over here. Alright, we're back in the blue switch room, over. 
go ahead and hit the blue switch and then walk back out to the hallway and turn left and keep walking up the stairs or down the stairs until you get to a room with four barrels and a long chest of some sort. Uh, there's four barrels and a table in here. Over. Yep, that must be a table then. Um, once you're in that room, turn to the right from where you walked in and walk up or down the stairs. Over. Yeah, there's something here. Hold on a second. Over. It's gone. Over. I don't know why I said over. In the okay, of that. well, walk up or down the stairs until you get to what should be the other side of the earlier closed blue gate that should now be open. Over. Do you mean the stairs that would be currently to my left? No. Turn to the right, down the hallway, and then keep going and you should see the open blue gate. Uh, turning to the right and going down the hallway. Oh, open blue gate right here. I passed right over it. Yep. Okay, you should be back in the green switch room. Are you? Over. Let's find out. Um. Yeah, over. Okay. Perfect. Now, can you please hit the green switch? Already done. Over. Now walk back through to the blue switch room. Over. Headed that way. Over. But no, yeah, there's very little downtime in this game. It's it's very instructional and, and requires a lot of forethought. I don't think I was here. I think I may have taken a wrong turn. Nope. Trusted my instincts, and I made it. Right, I'm in the blue, sw blue switch room again. What of it? Over. <laughs> what of it? Uh, hit the blue switch, please. Over. Alright, blue switch hit. Over. Now walk up or down the staircase out of the room and go right. And continue walking through the open blue gate until you get to the big room with the several staircases. Over. Alright, I passed the blue gate, and I'm still walking. Over. I only see two staircases in here, but uh, I'm in a room. Over. Are you in the green switch room, or...? Um... No, there is a green gate in here, though. Over. Is the green gate open? Over. The green gate is, in fact, open. Over. Walk through the green gate and hit the red switch in that room. Okay, alright. Red switch, red switch. I'm not seeing a red switch in here. Over. It should be on the far wall between a crate and a barrel. Over. It's not between a crate and a barrel, but I did find it. Over. Okay. Over. What could he have possibly interpreted as a barrel or a crate? Did you switch it? Over. Yeah, I flipped it. Over. Okay, now head back to the blue switch room. Over. On my way back. Over. So much navigation in this game. Trust me, all of this backtracking is part of the puzzle. It's not just me leading you astray. Over. Well, no, I didn't assume you were intentionally making me run around and press every switch in the game. Over. Have you made it to the blue switch room? Over. Uh, I'm still making my way there. Over. Right, this should be the blue switch room, yeah. No, it's not here. Oh shit, is it the pig pen? 
painting. That is the pig painting. Okay. What is this game? This is We Were Here. A 2017 two-player co-op game. Uh, did I get turned around? I uh, got a little turned around, but I am now in the blue switch room. Over. Copy. Hit the blue switch and then walk out to the left, back to the green switch room. Back to the green switch room. I know where that is. I know where that is, at least. Okay. Yeah, in my effort to do that, I have come across a shut blue gate, but maybe I got turned around. Hold on. Over. If it's shut in blue, go back to the room with the blue switch and hit it again. You must not have hit it the first time, or you might have hit it. Over. What the fuck could this puzzle co- like, what could possibly be worth this? Over. Survival? I, I don't know. Over. I am no more than three f switch flips away from fucking flipping my own switch. Over. Out to the left, let's see. I think I took a wrong turn. Let me know once you've gotten back to the green switch room. Over. Uh, yeah, I'm making my way there. I think I got a little turned around again. I, I've, like, suddenly I'm not able to navigate this place. Over. Jed has to be fucking with me, right? I, there's no way I, sw I flip switches over and over again for an hour and I'm fucking normal about it. Uh, this should be the green switch room. I'm gonna keep doing what Jed tells me to do for the time being, so I don't really have much choice, I guess. Yeah, I'm completely lost here. Over. Can you describe, like, have you made it back to a room with barrels and stuff? Can you describe that? Over. Uh, I just made it to a room. There's a table diagonal in the far corner. Oh, it's the blue switch room. I'm back in the blue switch room. I've managed to do a full fucking circle. Over. Okay, over. Hit the blue switch, and then walk out of the blue switch room, and turn left. Hit it again? I just hit blue switch. And don't hit it again. Then just walk out, and then turn left. Alright. Okay, where to now? To the right? Then once you've made it to the room, turn right and go up or down the stairs and continue walking until you get to the green switch room. The gate is shut. Over. I'm going back to flip blue switch again, I guess. Copy. Over. God, what is this game? What is this? I went into this completely blind. I got no clue what I'm doing. I readjusted my chair. I want to get back to blue switch room. Wow. Wow. Oh, I'm in this room, which means if I go back this way. Go back this way fully. No, this isn't it. And it's a dead end room. So. I'm lost, dude. Dude, I'm so lost, dude. Remember when this game was one whole room each at a time? Over. Yes, I do remember. I'm still in one room. Over. I'm in a fucking, like, unending labyrinth. Over. Have you hit the blue switch and now walking back to the green switch? 
Over. I got lost on my way to the blue switch. I'm headed back, though. Over. Copy. Over. This is not my bad. I shouldn't be having to sw flip switches for hours at a time. Okay, I'm back to blue switch room. I've flipped the switch. Now then, walk out of the blue room, turn left, and then walk to the green switch room. So you're gonna turn left, walk up or down the staircase into another room with barrels and a table, and you're gonna turn right and go up or down a staircase down into the hallway to the blue gate room. To the blue gate room. Gotcha. Gotcha. I'm here. Over. Now that you've gotten to the, what should be open blue gate, up oh. the green switch room, up or down the stairs. I'm currently in the green switch room, Jed. Excellent. Then hit the green switch and walk uh, up or down the staircase right next to the green switch. All right, where to now? Straight or to the left? To the left through the open red gate. Is there any more, anything more to that game? I don't know. To the left or the red gate. I have no idea. I, got, I know just as much as you do currently. Hey, we did it. I'm in like a snowy outdoor area now, like a courtyard. Over. Awesome. Um, we got an achievement for perfecting that, so there must be a way you can fuck it up. Over. I was pretty sure we did fuck it up somehow. Over. Okay, um... Oh god, I don't know how to play chess. The game has began to unload some of the parts. Oh, play, I won't need that room. Over. Right, I'm looking at a, ch a giant chess board, and I think I can interact with the pieces. I cannot interact with the pieces. Over. Okay, uh, a chess board. I, the tape that I have says the best plays in chess or whatever, so if I can play, if I can find a way to play that tape, I might have a solution for you. Over. All right, uh, there's also like a generator thing in the corner. It's got like a light on it. Oh, it doesn't look like I can do anything with it. Over. Okay, let me go ahead and see if I can figure out how to play this tape over. What is this? How does this work? Let me out. Jed, I regret to inform you I'm currently freezing to death. Over. How do I get out? Escape? I don't know how to help you with that. Can you walk back to the other room, maybe? Where you weren't freezing to death, over? Uh, no. The door's shut behind me. Over. Okay, well, this uh, video thing is, like, spinning, but it's not actually showing me anything. There's a crank, but it won't let me interact with the crank. Uh, so I don't... I, I'm going to try to figure it out, but I, you might die. Sorry. Over. Okay, so it turns out I can do something with the generator sitting out here. I can look at the dial on it. I can, like, interact with it. I, I don't know how it works, though. It looks like there's some kind of, like, mini game here. Over. Maybe try to play the mini game. Maybe that'll turn on the the power to the switch for the um, for the projector I have. Over. Oh, that didn't do it. Oh, I see. I see. There we are. There we are. The snow effect has gotten worse, though, so I think I'm going to freeze to death soon. I got the generator running, though. I figured out the minigame. Over. Okay, that hasn't changed my predicament with the film reel yet. Over. There was a crank. I turned the crank. Over. Never mind. I figured it out. Okay. You figured it out, huh? Oh, you figured it out, huh? Over. 
I figured it out as in I figured out how to get the projector running over. All right. Well, what do I do with these chess pieces? Over. Okay, I'm going to explain this to you, um, and yeah, I'll, yeah. So you're going to move two e to four e, and then you're going to move seven e to five e. What direction am I facing for those coordinates to make sense? Sorry, say that again. I, I, I'm, uh, over. I said, what direction am I facing for those coordinates to make sense? With white on my left or white on my right? White is the, um, the first, uh, fuck. The first rook is, uh, A1. First. What the fuck is a rook? There's two identical pieces at either end of this thing. Over. So, going from left to right, the rook is the castle piece. It's, uh, the white castle piece is A1. Over. So, A is in the middle of the board is what you're telling me? Over? N no, it shouldn't be. The cat, like, the castle piece? Over? All these pieces are designed to look like gnomes, dude. Over. <laughs> okay. Um, well then, so stand at the end of the board with white, then. Just, like, stand where white is. Okay, and then A is on my left. Like, my bottom left is A1. Over? Yes, your bottom left is A1. Over. So I need to move one, two, E to where? You need to move A, B, C, D, E. Sorry, move what to what? Over. E2 to E4. So the uh, it should be a pawn that you're moving over. E2 to E3, 4. Okay, moved it. What now? Now, move the opposing pawn on E. It should be... One moment, I have to reset the reel. It should be the black pawn on E7 to E5. So right in front of the other pawn. Over. E. I died. Yeah. What the fuck? I had shockingly little screen to work with there. I couldn't count shit. <laughs> I couldn't have counted shit, dude. Please tell me the checkpoint is past all the switch flipping. I would hope so. The snow effect is awful for this. Yeah, like, why did they put the snow effect on me for... Okay. Alright, I'm gonna set up the room. I didn't hear what you said, but I'm gonna set up the room. I'm gonna start the generator and everything, and then we'll do chess shit, alright? Copy. Over. All right, generator's running. Uh, tell me what pieces to move and where. Okay, move E4 to... A, B, C, D. One e. moment. E4 to E... e Fuck, four. E2 to E4. Fuck me. Sorry. Over. B, C, D, E. E2 to E4. Moved, right. What next? Now, move the black's pawn E7 to E5, directly in front of the other pawn. Over. 
Done. What now? Over. One moment. They're staring at each other. They're fighting. Now move F1 to C4. B, C, D, E, F, 1, 2, A, B, C, 1, 2, 3, 4. Done. What next? Uh, bear with me for one moment because I have to replay the video every time. Um, it's okay because this timer is kind of long anyway. And then do B7 to B6. A, B, B7. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, three, six. Done. What now? Still rolling through the tape to this part. Um, over. Right. Reminder to do fucking over every now and then. Now move D1 to F3. Over. A, B, C. A, B, C, D. One to E, F. One, two. He can't go that far. Oh, no, he can. He can. I'm stupid. Done. What next? Hurry, I'm, I'm fucking dying here. <laughs> Over, not really required in this section, considering. I can only go as fast as the projector will let me. Jet, I'm actively okay, dying. Okay, now move eight. C to or fuck, sorry, eight B nine B to eight C. Fuck. A B over. Nine B. Nine B to eight C. You said. Uh, sorry, eight B to six C. Fuck. Eight, sorry. Over. Eight B to six seven six C. Okay. Done. What next? I'm gonna die before now this is doable. Now move um, the the queen, the one that you had moved earlier. I have to reset the reel because it was it, it cuts off right at the end of the move. But it is uh, it is F three to F seven. Over. A B C D E F three. Four, five, six, seven, E. Oh, thank fuck. Oh my god, you don't understand how little screen I had left to work with here. Over. Okay, awesome. Uh, that was such a fucking pain in the ass because the projector had to reset every time. Over. I can't see, I can't see. Oh my god, I have my whole screen back. Over. You gotta- actually, no, you gotta watch that back on the VOD later, because Jesus fucking Christ. Over. I will. Over. Um, what are you looking at right now? Over. Uh, the first thing I saw entering the room is I died- MOTHERFUCKER! It's another- it's- it's a grid. There's a- there's a big, like, gridded floor. Uh, but directly in front of the door is a podium with a book on it that's got a set of symbols. It's open to a page with a set of symbols. Over. Uh, okay, so these are where the books go. Can you describe to me the symbols? Over. Alright, there's gonna be some fuck descriptions. Um, a rose, and then a very tall man, who's like all leg, no head. Uh, like an N and a J put together, but the J has like a ball on the end of it. A guy with his fucking fists in the air, and then like a building. Over. Does the building kind of look like a sailboat with an eye? No, it looks it it's it's very square. It's square with two square windows and a square door and a couple of like sprigs coming off either side of the top. Over. Okay, I found the one you're looking at. Over. There's the ones with the, the ones with the tans up. I get it now. Yeah. 
Okay, so this says before one starts in the west, take one step towards the eastern wall. Start off by taking two steps north. Move two steps to the eastern wall. You may go to the western wall after heading north twice. You may then leave. Okay. Uh, after starting in the west, take one step toward... Oh, before starting in the west, take one step toward the eastern wall. So that's second one from the left. Nope. Right in the middle. Okay, wait, hold on. Go back to that book that you were looking at the first time, over. Oh, the symbols change every time. This time, it's a... Uh, well, I'll tell you when you're ready. Over. I'm ready. Tell me the symbols. Okay, it's it's the rose symbol. Um, I see how you get cat with its hands up, by the way, but that is very obviously a rose. Um, and then the, like, doorway with a T on top of it again. And then the, like, J in the end with a ball over it. And then what looks like a hat rack, but with diamonds on the points of each of the three points. And then the fucking, like, weird sailboat with an eye thing. Over. Excellent. Oh, that made sense. Now, turn this book over to the exact opposite side, like click on it, and then look at the back of it. And you should have, or hopefully you have some sort of text back there. Over. Tell me what it says. I cannot interact with this book in any way. Over. Okay, then this is what it says. Starting from the far east, after moving two steps north. Far east. One, two... Let me know when you're ready for the next step. Alright, shoot me the next one. Over. Nope. Head two steps towards the west. Over. Hey, Jed, I fucked it. I, I, two steps towards, start in the east and take two steps toward the north meant take, like, stand on the first tile, then move to the second tile. Not start on the first tile in the east and move two steps north. But I get that now. We got a new set of symbols, though. Okay, tell me what symbols you're looking at. Uh, oh, no, I see cat with its hands up now. This is a particularly, like, uh, this one's, like, rounder. Cat with its hands up, and then the doorway with the T over it. And then what looks like a J with like a couple of lines, like like a J and an N, but like the top thing is like a like an oval. And then like a man with his fists in the air. And then a what looks like the sailboat thing, but squarer. Over. One moment. Still funny. Okay, I found it. Let me know when you're ready. Over. Um. Um. Give me, give me just one second. Give me just one second. Uh. Fuck. Hot take. Hot take. Hot take. Uh. I think. I think Fortnite's Battle Pass system is actually good. I like Battle Passes. I don't think every game that has a Battle Pass should have a Battle Pass, but I think the Fortnite, the way they accomplish it is good. The only thing I would add is like an after the fact, like uh, user generated market system for like, you know, items that were in the item shop four years ago. So they're still, ac so they're still acquirable, but not as, you know, acquirable. But most people hate Battle Passes. And I, I you know what, I did too, but then, you know, I started playing Fortnite again recently and. Anyway. Alright, sorry, had a hot take in chat. Uh, where am I going? Give me the thing. Okay. Starting in the far west corner. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm here. One moves north, north thrice. So three times. Over. So move one, two, three. Alright, I've made it that far. Over. Take one step south. Over. One step south. So if that's the west, then I have to backtrack. Alright, over. Over. 
Fuck me, I think we fucked it. Did it break over? No, I took one step south, and I, I, I mean, I backtracked. Um, I took three steps north, and then one step south. So we're here. Over. Okay, because the next si line says, but not before taking two steps east. Ah, okay, so two steps e east, then one step south. Got it. Yep, that did it. Over. You've made out? Over? No, I'm, I'm, I'm halfway there, but, like, that was the correct way to go. Over. Okay, okay well, now it just time, says, yeah, continue towards the eastern wall, then head towards the end of it all. Over. Hey, I'm free. Over. I'm glad we did it this way. I'm glad we did it this way. Okay, what are you looking at now? Over. Uh, I'm looking at a trap door in the floor, and then, like, a set of six cranks on the wall, and then a scene one lever. Over. Okay, well, I'm looking at a new room that looks like a theater, and it's got a stage. Over. Right, I just heard like a ladies and gentlemen thing. Oh, oh, am I up on the stage? I'm backstage. Okay, so I'm in like the backstage portion of where you're at. Over. Okay, and what were the levers you were looking at again? Over. Uh, there's a trap door in the floor, uh, a set of six cranks, and then a lever that says scene one, and a lever over in the corner that says floodlight. Over. Hit the floodlight lever. Over. Did it. Over. Now hit the scene one lever. Over. It flipped itself back into position. Over. Okay. You said there were three cranks. Over. There's a set of six cranks. Over. Begin cranking one of them. Over. Just any of them. Over. Just any of them. We're just trial and erroring right now. Over. Oh, if I if I hit E on one of them, it uh it just brings up the list of cranks. There are five cranks that are accessible. The sixth one I can't do anything with. Over. We'll try cranking one of them. Over. Just did. It didn't do anything. I'll try the next one. Over. Okay. Oh, oh, I see. No, I don't. Let's just go this way then. Hmm. What am I missing? Okay, I figured it out through pure trial and error. Over. Oh, no, I didn't. No, I didn't. Sorry. Over. The thing just okay, nothing had changed on my end. Over. Doesn't seem to matter where that lever is. Okay, that's most of those lit up. Oh, I'm. I think I'm just trying to get all these to light. No, okay, the lights on these just stick in a way that seems like there's a method, but there's not. Over. Okay, my apologies. I have found how to get up onto the stage. Uh, I have a little, uh, like, microphone thing. I'm going to listen to it real quick, okay? Over. All right, over. Uh, and now we wait. I'm, I'm looking at some sort of creature in the back. Over. Oh, over. Uh, when I begin to walk close to it, it looks like my screen is starting to close. Should I walk towards it? Over. 
No, that's the effect that I got before I, like, died. Over. Okay, over. Um, it said there once was something that lived in a castle. Over. Okay, over. Can you move any of the cranks now? Over. Just any of them? Over. Yes, just try one of them. I don't I don't have any corresponding to anything. Over. I'm cranking one of them. They can move left and right though. So, and there's 5 of them. So the correct combo could mean anything. Over. Okay. Uh move the next one. Over. Moving it. Over. There's something moving. Keep moving it. Over. I'll tell you when to stop. Okay. Over. One more crank. That it? Over. One more crank, Fox. I gave it one more. I gave it one more. Over. That's as far as it'll go? Over? Yeah, it's... I mean, I can free swing them either way that I want, but, like... It's not doing much. Over. Okay, well, crank that one back all the way. Over. Is it moving the scenery out onto the stage? Over? Yes, it is. Over. Alright, over. So, move the first one all the way to the right again. Fuck. Wrong direction, wrong direction. Sorry. I said right, and I went right. Oh no, now it's moving. Ah, fuck. Right makes it go left, and left makes it go right. I'm stupid. My bad. Over. Okay, perfect. Leave it as is now. Uh-huh. What now? Over. Move the next crank all the way you can. That doing anything for you? Over. Castle. Over. What? Over. Crank that one you just did all the way back. We don't want, uh, that's the queen. We don't want her. Gotcha. Over. Okay, now the next lever, I would like, uh, crank, crank the next lever all the way. I want to see what it is. Over. Alright, over. Okay, uh, pull that one back. Over. All right, over. Seems like Jed's getting the overall picture here, and I'm just doing the like. Okay, work. now crank the next one over. I don't have to say anything. I just crank it, and Jed will realize. That one's cranked all the way out. Over. Okay, pull that last one back. Over. Gotcha. Over. I'm getting real sick of this shit. I'm getting real sick of this shit. Done. Over. Okay, now, the second lever that you were pulling, pull that one back, okay? Over. Pulling it back. Over. Perfect. Now the last one you pulled, pull that one forward again. Over. Really riveting gameplay this is. Okay. That's good. Over. Alright, over. What did this mean? Is there any- oh fuck, is there any other levers you can pull? 
Uh, there's the scene one, like, full, like, switch, but that's it. Over. Okay, um, hit the scene one full switch. Over. There once was a castle filled with light. Okay, then crank the first switch all the way. You got it. That's good. Now crank the last switch all the way. Over. Alright. Gonna put that out. That's good. Over. What now? Over. Okay, now move. I think it was switches one and three. Over. Is that doing anything? I'm not hearing the noise. Over. Over. What did you say? Over. Move the first crank over. I was cranking the wrong way. Okay. Sorry. Crank it back. Over. Is Jed incompetent? Or is this really that difficult? I can't tell. Perfect. Over. Now crank the second Jed's switch all the way. Mistakes. My bad. Over. My Jed is prone to stupid mistakes, but... Nope. Other direction. Perfect. Now move the next switch over. Alrighty, 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 alrighty. Let's see. Perfect. Over. By the way, the text on the big lever swapped to say scene two now. Like, I mean, it swapped after scene one happened, so it's not, like, significant to where the levers are currently. Over. Oh, okay. Uh, crank, uh, hit the lever. Over. Fuck! Oh my god. The thing got what too the close to us. Fuck! The thing has what? been slowly approaching me. What is this game, dude? I've been doing nothing but flipping levers all game. <laughs> I, yeah, I don't know. Do you want um, to try from checkpoint? I mean, I'm... I'm yeah. Fine. Let's try it again, because I think we're right at the end here. This game feels like lever pulling the game. I, I don't... I don't understand. It seems like Jed understands the story, like Jed is getting the story and I am getting the do the fucking switch monkey boy type deal, dance monkey dance type deal, you know? Okay. Um, are you back? You gotta be fucking kidding me, I'm back at the room with the shit, yeah. Wait, you're back at the chess room? Or what room are you in? Oh. I'm, I'm in the room with like the, the book of symbols and the like tile puzzle. Fucking Christ. What symbols are you looking at on the book? Over. Uh, it's a rose, and then the, the door with the T over it, and then the NJ ball thing, and then the, like, diamond, like, topped, uh, coat rack, and then the sailboat. Over. Okay, starting from the far east, over. All right, over. Move two steps north. Over. That was wrong. Over. New set of symbols. What symbols are you looking at? Uh, oh my god. Okay, cat with hands up. I totally see what you mean, because it's cat with hands up, and then it's penis. 
and then it's like the NJ thing, but with the oval this time, and it's squarer. Uh, then the diamond topped coat rack, and then the sailboat. Over. Uh, perfect. Um, that was West. I'm stupid. Okay, okay my game my glitched up. Uh, give me a moment. Uh, so this one says, "In the western corner, start. In the western corner lies your start." Yep. Over. Keep moving north, but watch your step before the last tile you must head east. Over. How far east? Over. Two steps east, it seems. Over. Alright, where to now? Over. Now take one step south. Over. Got it. Over. Where to? Head for the eastern wall, then you may proceed towards the door. Got it. We're back to the fucking stage shit. Alright, what now? Okay, give me a moment to get back to the stage. Over. Oh. I wanted to do We Were Here 1 and 2 this stream, but I think one game per stream might be it. Especially since I did an 8 hour stream last night. Okay, now the first crank, crank it all the way. Over. Alright, let's see where this goes. Perfect. Now the last crank. Crank it all the way. Over. At least we know what we're doing this time, for the most part. At least Jed's memorizing what the cranks go to. Like, that's good effort on him. That's good. Over. Why the if you will stop sending me TikToks right now. Now hit the uh, scene one lever. Over. All right, what now? Crank the first switch all the way. Over. Did I not do the first switch already? Okay, what now? Now crank the sweat second switch all the way. Over. All right, all right, all right. I'm glad I caught that. I'm glad I caught that. Now the third crank all the way. Over. Perfect. Now hit the scene two switch. Over. And there lived a king and his wife. That was neat. What next? It just okay, says so all is happy and all is good. Hold on one moment. Over. Okay, crank the first switch all the way. So we used our first attempt to get our bearings. Now so crank the second switch all the way. Over. We should have our bearings now. Now crank the third switch all the way. Over. Okay, alright, alright, alright. We're going, we're going, we're going. Now crank the fifth switch all the way. Over. Alright. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Perfect. Now hit the scene lever.
We gotta do another one? Do we gotta do another one? Okay, now move the fourth crank all the way over. Go, 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 go. And crank back the fifth crank over. One, two, three, four, five. Crank it back. Crank it back. Cranking, cranking, cranking. What now crank back the second crank over. over. And second crank too. I wish I could see now what I was the doing. Lever. Over. I get why I can't, but... That was wrong. That was wrong. Okay, crank back the third lever then. Over. I got confused because I'm counting. Perfect. The Try the lever again. Over. Do I return it all or no? That did not work. Over. Wait, don't you? Sorry, Wait, crank two. forward the fifth lever. Over. One, two, three, four, five. Come forth. Jed better not be using me to just trial and error this bullshit. Okay, hit the switch again. Over. Like, I don't want to assume that's what Jed is doing. Jed, are you using me to trial and error this bullshit? No, I'm not. I'm trying to figure out what the fuck it means by this. Uh, crank forward the third lever. Over. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, now hit the switch again. Over. Oh, thank fuck. Perfect, that worked. Alright, what now? Over. Okay, now crank forward lever one and lever four. All the way. Over. Alright, let's do it. And now lever four. Over. Two, three, four. Okay, now hit the scene switch. Over. All right, scene five. Didn't work. Didn't work. Over. Lever three then, over. Bring in lever three. Give it up for lever three, everybody. Woo! Everybody's favorite character, lever Perfect. three. Perfect, now hit the scene switch. Didn't work. Waiting for Jed. Uh, I don't know what else it can mean by this. Hold on. Okay, waiting on Jed. Okay, crank back lever two and crank forward lever three. Okay. Oh, that wasn't lever three that I was cranking. Perfect. Just then, crank forward lever home. three. Perfect. Now hit the switch. Over. I realized as I was doing that, that was my bad. All right, so it's a set of six levers, but the first one is not a usable lever. And so when you say lever three, my brain wants to do lever two because it's the third one, and it's it's fucking stupid. Anyway. <laughs> okay, we'll hit the switch. What the fuck? Crank forward lever four, maybe a little bit? Not doing anything. Over. Um, I, I don't know what else it could be, um, 
And crank forward level four, five then? Lever five then? Over. By the way, we only have so many attempts left at, left at this. My vision is, like, narrowing here. Over. Yeah, the guy is here. Uh, hit the switch again. Over. Jet is totally trial and error in this. Okay, I genuinely have no clue what it wants from us, then. Um, crank back lever five. Over. Also, I don't know why I have to manually turn the lever so many times. And crank back lever three. Over. Two, three. Put it away, put it away, put it away, put it away. Oh, I see. Crank back lever four as well. Over. Okay. And now crank forward lever two. Over. We've wasted too much time. There's no way this works out for us. Okay, and then hit the switch. No. Fuck! This game sucks, dude. This shit is bad. I don't know how to tell you. Yeah. I don't know how to tell you that this game fucking sucks and I'm not playing the second one. <laughs> People like this game. People like the second how. one more. I don't know how. Um, as in, like, you don't want to do the second half of the stream? Uh, well, I'm thinking it might just be better to do a shorter stream tonight anyway after a fucking eight-hour grind, but I'll finish Fair this enough. One. All right. Like, I'm, I'm down to finish it. I'm not rage quitting. I just fucking, like, I'm not sure if I'm up for another lever-flipping bonanza tonight. All right, I'm ready to read off the symbols whenever you are. What symbols are there over? Uh, Rose, man with long legs, uh, J with an N with like the ball thing on top again. Uh, and then the man with his hands up, like his fists in the air, uh, and then the like squared off building. Over. Perfect. All right, uh, go to the before one starts in the west take one step towards the eastern wall okay so then one away from the west wall wrong new set of symbols uh start by taking two steps to the north new set of symbols okay what are the symbols over uh cat with its hands up uh, door with a T on top of it. The J N thing, but with an oval and like the squarer one. The man with his hands up, and then the same like sailboat eye thing, but squarer again. Okay, starting in the far west corner. Okay. Three times. Sorry, you said starting in the far west corner, move where three times? North three, north three times. All right, done it. Where to now? Now take two steps to the east. All right, done. What now? Now take one step south. Got it. After that. Now continue all the way to the eastern wall. Done. And head towards the end of it all. And done. Okay. Alright, back to fucking levers. At least this time I, I know what levers you need to pull. I wrote them all down last time over. Oh, thank god. Alright, what are we doing? Gentlemen, welcome to tonight's feature show. Come on, Jed, what are we doing? Okay, crank, crank one all the way. Over. One all the way. I actually don't know if it'll just continue if I stop. Perfect, now crank, crank five all the way. Over. 
cranking five, cranking five. Bing, bing, bing. Bing, 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 bing. Okay, now hit the scene switch. Over. Scenes. There once was a castle filled with light. All right, going again, going again. <laughs> this shit is so bad. Now crank forward all the way, crank one. Over. Crank one. And crank forward all the way, crank two. Over. And crank two. Now crank forward all the way, crank three. Over. And crank three. Okay, now hit the scene switch. And there lived a king with his wife. Waiting. Bang, 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 bong. Okay, now crank forward lever one all the way. Crank forward lever one all the way. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Okay, we got it this time. I'm getting hype about lever cranking. Now crank forward lever two all the way. And crank forward lever three all the way. Lever three. Lever three, lever three, lever three, lever three. Bing and bong. crank forward lever five all the way. Lever five. All right. Okay, now hit the scene switch. I like that I'm making a play play out that I'm not allowed to see. Okay, now crank back lever two. Okay, cranking it back, cranking it back. And crank forward lever four. Lever four, crank it forward. Now, a scene. Alright. Forward now crank forward crank one. Over. Crank forward crank one. Got it. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. And crank forward crank two. Over. Now crank over crank three. Over. Crank and crank three, crank and crank three. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Crank three. Give it up Perfect. for crank three. Uh, hit the switch. Perfect. Okay. Crank back, crank three. Over. Goodbye, crank three. It was good knowing you. See you and later, now hit friend. The Nowhere for that to move. Okay, I was just double checking that I did put that all the way back. Okay, crank I'm back, crank two. And crank forward, crank four. One, two, three, four. Okay, now hit the switch. Hitting the switch. Oh, fucking god damn it. Crank back, crank one. Over. Cranking it back, cranking it back. Keep cranking. Crank back, crank four, over. Goodbye, Crank 4. Hope I never have to interact with you ever again. 
Crank Goodbye. forward, crank two, over. Okay, okay, okay. Now hit the scene switch. Ba bam. Done. Okay. That doesn't look great, but whatever. The trap door. Okay, the trap door opened for me. Are you there? Yeah, the trap door opened for me too, but the collision is still the same as if it were closed, so I can't go down there. Uh, press E on the open hole. Over. Oh my god, oh my god, that was a weird interact. Hold on. There we go, over. Oh, is that you? Gamer? Hello. You just turned to face me? You're not Jed. Uh, is that you? I mean, it looks like I'm out of here. Do we still have to talk through the walkie-talkies? Yes, we do, it seems. Uh-huh. Walk through the gate over there. I'm leaving. See you later, dickhead. And then there might be- Oh, okay. Game's over! Are you there? Yeah. Okay, so yeah, it's just pick one of us. It Was there another way? Fuck you if there was! What sacrifice? You were standing in the hallway with me! You could have left! You could have walked away with me! I was standing on me. a pressure plate. I was standing on a pressure plate. Oh, I see. I, I didn't I didn't see that that Is was a there... pressure plate. I thought you were just hanging out in a square. I, I, I will not lie. I looked that up. So, crank one was the castle scene. Crank two was king. Crank three was queen. Crank four was the king holding a sword. And then crank five was people. So for the entire play, we've had the castle there the entire fucking time. Uh huh. But for the last slide, when it just says, and there he stood, covered in blood, they just, they wanted to, they wanted just the king and the, the spotlight. Oh my god. It was fucking stupid. <laughs> that is fucking stupid. <laughs> I agree. God that was damn it. Like, I, yeah. <coughs> I want to play the other ones because I've heard they're very good, but that soured my taste, man. Yeah, I, I, I wouldn't right now, mostly because, like, partially I'm good for a shorter one, and it might be better to split them into individual streams anyway, you know? Okay, yeah, let's let's just do that. We, You still want to come back to it next week? Or? No, I still want to come back to it next week. I'll still do okay. it next week. I just, like, in the heat of, like, I've been flipping levers for two hours, I, I don't know that, you know? Yeah, all right. Like genuinely, All right. we'll 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 look at my footage in a minute. All right, I'll see you in a sec. Give me, I'm gonna do see you in a bit. Quick. Yep. Bye bye. Feel free to close the game whenever. All right, everybody. So that was we were here. I'm not as mad about it as I seemed. It just kind of was like a fr a couple of frustrating solutions. I kind of liked the the early puzzles in it, and I even liked the the pressure plate puzzle. Like it felt very cooperative puzzle solving, right? But that last puzzle really just, like, completely soured my taste. Like, the, the puzzle with the rooms, I could be convinced most of the issue that we had was one of us was being stupid at the time, and the other one was not. You know? Between me and Jed, because, like, I was getting lost in those hallways nonstop, and, and, you know, Jed was, like, master of the knowledge for 90% of it, and so... And so I'm just lost as to... Yeah, from what I've seen of the other ones, they seem better. Yeah, I bought them all, so we'll play them all. We'll play them on the stream. I, I don't mind. But, like, it was... Yeah, it was it was, it was was a rough, rough time. Anyway, let's find somebody to raid. I know it's been a short one, but it's because the game was short. Don't blame me. I mean, I guess you kind of could blame me, because, you know. But... Uh... I've been trying to raid new folk. I've been trying to raid new folk. Uh... Doing staff interviews. 
What do you mean staff interviews? All right, I'm curious as to what under the just cat chatting category. Oh, they're interviewing for like staff positions. Okay, I see. They got like 40 viewers. Fuck this. I'm not writing into somebody with 40 viewers. Chum Dave? Chum Dave? I shouldn't laugh at people's fucking Twitch names. Here's somebody else from Twitch SMP we can raid into. I know we raided somebody from Twitch SMP the other day. I know I like to shake it up here, but that'll that'll do if nobody has any suggestions. All right, so slash raid, bada bam, done. Raid initiated. So, if you enjoyed the stream, I've, I've got other streams that are that are more uh, where I'm playing games I'm more enthused about that like you might enjoy uh, over on my VODs channel exclamation point VODs. Uh, where you can find all of my previous streams organized by game being played in them. And... Oh, Thicky just went live. We're gonna miss him. We're gonna miss... I watched it appear on the sidebar. We're gonna miss Thicky. Oh, no. We'll get him next time, though. Exclamation point VODs. Exclamation point VODs will link you to my VODs channel. Oh, wait, I already did that one. Exclamation point socials will link you to my social media. I get turned around sometimes, all right? Uh, where you can see all of my social medias, like Twitch and Twitter and 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 YouTube, where I post other content. Um, and that'll do it for me, folks. I'll see you tomorrow for probably some Next Fest demos. I want to get, like, four hours worth of Next Fest demos and play those. So it'll either be that or it'll be uh, modern beta or better beta. All right, I'll see you guys on the flip. Womp womp.